sisters all know. So what do you think about that Dean Z? <laughs> Jeff and I were sitting backstage and we're, we're kind of attuned to the sounds of an audience. I mean, we've been doing this a while. Jeff's been doing it a lot longer than I have. But we're attuned to the sounds that an audience makes, the ooh and the eye and the clapping. We actually were back there and we heard sounds from you guys that we've never heard an audience make. Trace it back to did Dean do something with his shirt? To, to, yeah. I could do that right now. You make a sound. You can do that. Man's got to know his limitations. As as Rianne calls me, festival dad. That's my name, festival dad. I feel like festival granddad sometimes, but you know. Uh, all right, next up, it's a portion of the show. It's a new uh, part of the show that's going to be a part of uh, all of Jeff's festivals coming up in the future, and it's called the Protege. And our first protege is somebody that we met years ago, and a lot of you might have been in Tupelo the year that he portrayed young Elvis at the Tupelo Hardware Store. Jeff met this gentleman through Carolyn. Uh, he was dating uh, this gentleman, not Jeff, Jeff dating Carolyn's uh, granddaughter. <laughs> Make sure my, my pronouns and nouns and subjects and everything agree. Uh, but Carolyn said, can you take a look at this guy? He's, a, he's an Elvis guy. And Jeff's like, oh, that'll be good, I'm sure. And he was blown away by it. And we've watched him mature and we've watched him grow. And he has studied with Jeff about how to do this, how to how to produce a show, how to put something together. And he is now, and I, I don't know that this is official, but by my calculations, and I don't know math, uh, I think he might have more licensed productions coming up from EPE than any one producer. Because, because let me tell you something, anybody can go out and rent a ballroom and put on a karaoke track and have an Elvis festival. Yeah. Anybody can do that. And there's people doing that. And God bless them for doing that. But this young man said, no, I want to do it. I want to work with EPE. I want to be able to use Elvis's name and not get sued. I want to be able to use Elvis's imagery and not get sued because he deserves the best. So our first protege from the Jeff Lewis School of Festival Management. Please welcome Cody Dannon. Quick. 